Sometimes different diseases have similar signs and symptoms. Rheumatoid arthritis and gout have certain key similarities despite being very different diseases. So how does your doctor know if you have RA or gout? One illness that is sometimes mistaken for rheumatoid arthritis is gout, a condition in which uric acid builds up in your joints. Rheumatoid arthritis, or RA, occurs when your immune system mistakes the lining of your joints for being a foreign substance and attacks and destroys it in response. Gout, on the other hand, is a hereditary condition caused by high uric acid in the blood that crystallizes in joints, leading to joint destruction. Uric acid is formed as a byproduct when your body breaks down old cells and makes new ones. It is also produced when your body breaks down certain foods like meat, high fructose corn syrup, and beer. With gout, your kidneys have trouble getting rid of excess uric acid, leading to the abnormal levels in your blood. Normally, you get rid of most of your uric acid through your kidneys. But if your body makes uric acid faster than your kidneys can get rid of it, you may develop gout. Like RA, gout causes pain, inflammation, and discomfort in one or more joints. Gout can also cause your body to produce rheumatoid factor, leading to lab tests that look like RA. Uric acid buildup can occur anywhere in the body. When it does so under your skin, it produces a tophus, plural, tophi, that may resemble rheumatoid nodules, another symptom of RA. Both conditions may cause a fever and make you feel run down. So how can your doctor tell if you have RA or gout? Well, one clue is the joints affected. Both conditions are likely to affect your hands, wrists, knees, ankles, and feet. But with RA, the pain is symmetrical, affecting the same joint on both sides of the body, typically the hands, knuckles, and feet. Gout, by contrast, is most likely to start in just one joint and typically one farthest from your body, like your big toe. The pain you feel with gout is often sudden in onset and can be intense. It may wake you up in the middle of the night. RA is painful, but not as intense and is most commonly characterized by stiffness for at least a half an hour when you first wake up. Gout comes in attacks that typically last a week or two, even if not treated with medicines, whereas RA symptoms never subside on their own. But the main distinction is what is found on lab tests. To diagnose gout, your doctor will likely draw blood to check your uric acid level and may even take some fluid out of the affected joint and have it checked for uric acid crystals. If these are seen, it will completely confirm the diagnosis of gout. Doctors rely on some similar medications for symptom relief in gout and RA. These are non-steroidal anti-inflammatory drugs, or NSAIDs. In gout, they are used to get rid of the attack, and in RA, they are used long-term to lessen symptoms. Conversely, long-term RA treatment is more complex, often using NSAIDs regularly and also incorporating drugs that strategically dampen your immune system to prevent it from destroying your joints. Both diseases respond to long-term treatment, but knowing which condition you have is key to receiving proper treatment. And the sooner you receive proper treatment, the sooner you will start feeling better and prevent permanent joint damage.